Hey you, what's good? This is not at all my typical video, but I need to do it. Because messing with this stupid device wasted an hour of my day yesterday. So if your Yeti X is not working, or doesn't have any of those sound bars lighting up, and only has this blue light burning, then I will help you. So in order to fix it, you need to subscribe first and uh, check my other videos later. But now let's get it. So I hooked up this microphone to my laptop, and it only showed me this blue microphone LED. Sadly, there was no voice signal in my PC, and none of those input LEDs even lit up. So, microphone was kinda muted, although it wasn't. If I turned the knobs, I could see those LEDs lighting up. You probably googled your solution, but you never found one. That's why you're here. So did I. Like you went into the device manager, settings, uninstalling the drivers, reinstalling the drivers, troubleshooting and other shit. But fear not, the solution is simple. No one told you that you need to factory reset your Yeti X. It's as simple as that. So first thing you need to do is to unplug your Yeti X from the USB port. There are two buttons for this microphone, one in the front and one in the back. You need to press and hold both of these buttons right at the same moment when you plug your USB in. I will hold it this way so you will see. But you need to remember that you need to keep holding those buttons at least 10 seconds. When you see the front button rapidly flashing, I actually need to move my fat finger in order to see when it's blinking or not. And then you can release both of these buttons. So I will do it right now. I'm almost ready to plug it in to my USB port. I'm holding my fingers ready and I will do it all at once. Ah, uh, you can't see it, but it's flashing. Now it's green. Because you only see the rim of the flashing light and <laughs> it usually blinks red. But if you keep holding it, then you won't be able to see if it's blinking or not. So you kind of need to move your finger away while holding it in. And it takes approximately seven, maybe 10 seconds and then you can release it and your PC will recognize your microphone and start working again. I mean, was that so hard? Was that so hard to describe something like this in a YouTube video. No, it wasn't. Why the hell haven't you made one? Why did I have to waste my time to make this video? The hell with you people!